boys call you sexy And you don't care what they say See every time you turn around and scream in your name Now I've got a confession Hey guys, it's Sunday And I'm Amy and I'm your host for The Biggest Beauty Project So this week we're talking about why we are who we are in our life. The first question is, what are you doing with your life and why? Well right now, obviously, I'm in high school. I attend a public high school in my town and uh, I kind of don't like it, but I do like it. What I want to do with my life, I want to go to college, I want to be successful. In college, I either want to major in political science or foreign language, or maybe even combine the two and double major or minor in one of them. I don't, I don't know. The second question is, what made you who you are today? Experience. I'll have to fill whoever else said that I don't remember at this right now. Um, experience, definitely. If there's some things that happened to me that, if they didn't happen to me, I, I wouldn't... I wouldn't have that behind me and I, I wouldn't know what to do for certain situations or give other people advice and it just helps. How did you get to be where you are in life? Through trial and error and through just experience again really. They're kind of the same thing. I mean, I have lived my life completely, obviously. I'm only 16, but I've tried to do the best that I can with what I've done. To go along with who I am, what I am, how I am, uh, actually about a week ago, last Sunday, I got back from this retreat called Snowball at a club that I'm in hosts it, and it's the most amazing weekend of your life. Oh my god. What you basically do is, it's a weekend of positivity. All you do really is just learn to love yourself. Um, we did things from vision boards to something called warm fuzzies. And it's just amazing. I was part of the red team. We got these. I'm representing right now. On the other side of this, it has my group members' names. I had them sign it. I'm not going to show you right now because I don't feel like taking this off. And I just loved my group. We were called the Red Squad. And we were the 50s because that was our theme. Each team had a decade to be and a color. And we were the 50s and we were red. So to go along with the 50s theme, they got us records. And on these records is my name and the year it says words that my group said about me and I shared with them that I'm on this channel and they were so happy for me. I was the motivator of the group because we shared life stories and I just shared this because it's what's going on in my life right now. I'm going to show you if you can see them. And that was pretty much the funnest weekend I've had in a while. My group, one of my group members asked me to do a shout out. So I'm going to do a shout out to you, Anna. Because you're a cool kid and it hurts. So right now I'm going to show you some pictures from Snowball. Enjoy! Can't expect to do it. understand what snowball is unless you've gone on something like it but you just imagine this complete weekend 
of self-esteem upridge, boosting your self-esteem constantly for an entire weekend in some beautiful place that I'm going to show you a picture of now. Just being with people who like you. I'm going to ask a question for everyone to answer this week because I'm not sure what the topic is. But my question to you guys is, if you could have dinner with anyone, dead or alive, who would it be and why? I'll answer that question on Tuesday when I see you guys. So, links are on the sidebar. You guys need to comment, rate, and subscribe. And I'll see you on Tuesday.